Cedric Gray, you ruined my life. That 4-3 is real. He skated ah. everybody. The thing that everybody wanted, everybody been waiting for, Coach Deion Sanders has lost his first game at JSU. I knew it. Stop the cap. <laughs> hey, man. That's football for you. You can lose any day of the week. Man, I know what y'all really came for. Ezra Gray, you ruined my life! Ryan Nettles, why are you so composed in the pocket doing pressure? Defense, stop somebody. Jalen Jones, complete a pass. But no, I'm not doing that. It's one game. You win some, you lose some. But you live. You live to fight another day. The ASU defense is not to be played with. They penetrated that line that had Jalen Jones running for his life. Pressure coming in. Jones trying to escape. He's going to fumble the football. The 27. Here it comes. Pressure again. The pass is caught. Outside, outside, outside. I get credit where credit is due. They outplayed us in many phases. Came down to the wire. We had opportunities. We fell short. Proud of you, because you fought back. You really did. But we got to learn how to do what? Finish. We learned a lot today. And trust me, we see everything. Hey, man, I'm proud of y'all. I'm proud of y'all. Alabama State are babies. Freshmen and sophomores. And the confidence they're going to play with for the rest of the year is going to be crazy, man. Come down, take a look around. What's going down? Man, they feel like they can beat anybody. Matter of fact, the throw that Ryan Nettles made that was a touchdown on three JSU defenders. Shirt freshman, second career start, looks end zone, throws, caught, touchdown, Booker. Well, three JSU defenders in the area. We don't know what the actual coverage responsibilities were. That showed his confidence level. He fears no one. Alabama State feared no one. 27 of 42, 257 yards, two touchdowns, two interceptions. Ezra Gray, 8.5 yards a carry? Come on, man. That's outrageous. Get a week off, and we're going to see how they respond in the next game against Alabama A&M. Abdul Ibrahim has only been held under 85 yards in swag play one time. One time. Time. And guess who did that? Alabama State. They locking up everybody. But the one thing I did learn today, hey, they know they know HBCU football is here. It ain't going nowhere. Cut day, cut day sports, us, we're not going anywhere. We're going to be here. We're going to see the job through. We're going to make sure that HBCU football gets the recognition it deserves, and we're going to do it our way. And that's cut they approved them out.